watching Global Daily Mirror News Alert. President Bongo Marcos conducted an aerial inspection on Tuesday, November 8 in Typhoon Paeng hit areas in Antique. At a situation briefing in the province on Tuesday, Marcos said he noticed that infrastructure was the biggest problem in Antique, noting that it has to be fixed to ensure unhampered delivery of goods and services to residents. Antique Governor Odora Cadiao earlier said the province has been facing a shortage in fuel products as it was isolated from its neighboring provinces because of the destruction of major bridges. She said bridges connecting Antique to Aklan and Iloilo were destroyed by floods caused by Paeng. The reported fatalities due to Typhoon Paeng have increased from 156 to 158, the National Disaster Risk Reduction and Management Council said on Tuesday. Based on the NDRRMC's latest report, most of the fatalities were reported in Bangsamoro Autonomous Region in Muslim Mindanao with 63 deaths, followed by Western Visayas with 36 and Calabarzon with 33. Only 123 of the total reported fatalities have been confirmed so far, while the rest are still up for validation, according to the NDRRMC. At least 142 people were reported injured and 34 were still reported missing, the NDRRMC added. Police Lieutenant General Felipe Natividad took his oath as the Chief of Philippine National Police in a simple ceremony held on Monday. PNP Police General Rodolfo Azurin led the oath-taking and donning of the rank for Police Lieutenant General Natividad, currently the commander of the Area Police Command in Northern Luzon, as the PNP Chief. The shear line is affecting northern Luzon. According to Pag-asa, the shear line and easterly winds will bring cloudy skies with scattered rain showers and thunderstorms over Batanes, Cagayan, Isabela, Quirino, Aurora, Quezon, and Bicol region. As for Metro Manila and the rest of the country, localized thunderstorms is possible in the afternoon or evening. TikTok star Bella Porch files for a divorce. In case you missed it, yes, Bella Porch was married and filed for divorce from her husband of almost four years, Tyler Porch, TMZ reported on Sunday, November 6. According to the entertainment website, they obtained legal documents showing Bella, whose real name is Denary Porch, which cited irreconcilable differences as the reason for filing for divorce. Bella and Tyler were said to have tied the knot in 2019. Meanwhile, Rebel Wilson welcomes her first child. American actress Rebel Wilson, who starred in Pitch Perfect, shared a sweet photo on Instagram introducing her newborn daughter. The actress thanked her surrogate who carried and gave birth to her baby with such elegance and care for all the years in the making she said this had taken. Back in June, Rebel made her relationship with Ramona Agruma public. She denied rumors that they were engaged earlier this week. And that's the latest for this hour. Subscribe to our YouTube, Facebook, and Instagram and visit www.globaldailymirror.com. This has been Ice Martinez. Good day.